Harry Potter go? Dude. Hey, dude, the pizza's here. Man, what took so long? It's been like 40 minutes. I know, man. This totally breaks the 30 minute rule. Man, that's ridiculous. You shouldn't have... I hope you didn't leave a tip. Well, I had to, dude. It's the most important thing. Always leave your pizza man a tip. It's like, it's extreme truth, it's Jude. Man, I cannot get used to your new look. Why not, man? I look totally freaking sexy. Well, maybe to you. I don't think guys are hot, in my opinion. You did, apparently, when you turned me into a chick. But, I don't think guys are sexy. Hey, you still holding that thing against me now? I mean, come on. That was like an accident, man. Yeah, an accident that we had to travel halfway across the world to fix, man. <laughs> hey, you just can't, you just can't pass up total genius. Those skills were done all by me. Man, whatever, man. I still can't believe you took one of those potions. Whatever, and, dude. Well, whatever. it's just, you look like a totally different person now. What am I supposed to say? I mean, I look beautiful. I mean, look at me. Before, I was not, I was not this cool looking. Now look at me. Well, I don't suppose you could do the same for me. Maybe. I mean, just let me try. Just trust me, dude. I can turn you into something like this. Yes, I know you can turn me into something. I don't want to turn to a woman again or any other freaky stuff. Dude, are you going to trust me? Well, you did get rid of my zit. Uh, the pizza's probably cold anyway. So, was it going to hurt? I guess we can, yeah. I guess we can try this, man. Alright then. Well, first, why don't we just eat pizza first and then we'll just go ahead and go from there. How's that? Alright, that sounds good to me. Boy, I'm starving. Where's the pizza? What the hell? Where Did is you get hungry pizza? again? I'm sorry, dude. It's just this new look makes me hungry. Man. You didn't tell me not to eat it on the way up here. Uh, let's just, let's just go with this potion thing, man. Alright, well, Before... let me just stop by the store, because I need to get some more stuff. Okay, whatever. Alright, I'll be back, okay? So, just stay here. Crazy guy. Yeah, we gotta get that door fixed. Anyways, I'm back. We've got to get that door fixed, bro. Man, what took you so long? I was shopping, dude. I was trying to get that stuff for us. So we can, uh, so we can turn you back into, into sexy again. All of this? How's it? Wait, what are you saying? You saying I'm not sexy, man? I'm not saying you're not sexy. I'm just saying that you can use a little more touch to your look. A little more touch? So you're saying that Trust all... me, if you want that girl you want, then you're going to want that get that touch. Alright, man. Let's do this. But I did a little bit of extra shopping. I bought myself a video game. What the heck? 
What? What, you told me to get what, whatever I need? What does video games have anything to do with my looks? Well, while you're busy turning yourself into... You need to be focusing on me and not a dumb video game. Sorry, dude. You want me to take a bath? I mean, I can. <sighs> Never mind. Let's just... I figured it would be something cool to play, so that Let's just it. get this situated. I don't care about the dumb video game. Let's just do this. And this it's not, time... It's not very dumb. I mean, it's actually... It's actually about survival mode. I mean, it's really I, cool. I really don't care about your video game. It's got a lot of, a lot of zombies in it. I it's just really cool. want to look uber sexy right now, man. Uber se well, I don't think guys are sexy, though. Touché. Let's just get this over with. I can make you into a better looking Look, person. As long as I'm better looking. And this time I better not have boobs. So would you rather have a uh, female body part and sick? Boobs are a female body part genius. Well I've seen fat guys have boobs. Fat people aren't sexy. <laughs> Some girls think they do. I've seen this. Hey, I've seen I could have swore I've seen this. Like 400 pound dude. He's going out with this really, really skinny eye chick that was from a cheerleader squad or whatever. And I could have swore. What does any of this have to do with my looks? I'm just saying. It, it's not all about your looks, bro. It's also about your personality. You gotta have the touch like me, man. You have to have the personality just like me. Well, where do you want this stuff at? I don't know. You bought the stuff. I don't even know what's in the bag. Well, we have some uh, potions. Got some. Uh, got a video game. Let's just go over here and figure this out. Hi. The doctor is here. Not this again. You don't even look like a doctor. But duh, it's radioactivity doctor. It's awesome doctor. Awesome doctor? Yeah. What? I'm confused. How are you confused? How are you an awesome doctor? Because awesome doctors can fix anything. So you work with radioactivity? Yeah. Look at this. What the heck? What does that say? Warning. You can go blind for my pure awesomeness. <laughs> what the heck, man? Why not? Okay, Mr. I work with radioactivity. Okay, Mr. Dr. Strange Love. It's called Dr. Awesome. Awesome Love. You have to have awesome love if you want this commitment with this girl you like to work. Don't have to give you some history lessons. That can put you to sleep faster than you can say Gabba Jabba G. I'm sorry, I fell asleep for a minute there. Alright. I said I can <coughs> Let's just get this over. I can put you to sleep faster than you can say Gabba Jabba G. Here we go again.
this stuff takes longer. Man. What is that? It's a, uh... It's blue! What else do you want from me? Did you just have that sitting under there all this time? Well, what does it look like? It definitely wasn't floating. So you went shopping... <sighs> so this is the potion I'm supposed to take? Kind of, yes. Has to sit. This has to mix with this. This at least has to sit for 24 hours before tilting. And how long has that been under there? 48. Then it should be okay, right? Well, I don't know, but if you keep bothering me, it may not be. So, can I. can we do this now? Well, we can try. If you give me a minute, I will just do this here. Fine. Always sanitize your utensil. Always. This is the right amount, man. Alright. Drink. This is deja vu all over again. Do you trust me or not? What? Do you trust me or not? Well, you sweep the floor at the pharmacy and you're a janitor, so I don't really know. <sighs> not my fault nobody else sweeps the floors for a couple of years, so I had to take over the job because nobody else was compassionate enough to sweep the floors. And is that why you're such an awesome doctor? I am an awesome doctor. Look! I don't know about this, man. Just drink. Flush. Dude, are you dead?
Dude, you don't sound too good, dude. Dude, you okay? Dude, you're a zombie. It's so freaking righteous, dude. Zombies these days become shorter and shorter every minute. Speaking of zombies, there is one living in our dorm. Idiot. I swear, zombies could be almost like drunk people. You never know what the hell they're gonna do. What the heck they're gonna do next? Oh, well, that's real pretty. Oh. Speaking of zombies, uh, nine bottles of beer on the wall, nine bottles of beer. Pass one down, take, take one down, pass it around. Now, zombies drunk. Ninety bottles of beer in a wall. Ninety bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. I was another zombie drunk. Well, apparently this zombie forgot his thinking cap. This guy, I can guarantee you, he has no clue where he's going. Well, at least he knows how to open a door. Yeah. Do you ever wonder sometimes what would happen if a, if a zombie got raped? Would they actually call it rape? Or would they just moan? Ooh, squirrel. Notice how the bright color of pink catches your eye. Too bright. Apparently there's a fire exit. Dang. Maybe this is one of those blind zombies. He definitely doesn't know where the heck he's going then. This is a proven fact. Zombies do watch TV.
only problem is they don't know how to turn on the TV. Uh oh. This zombie has definitely found his sex toy. He is now entering the game room. Well, he has now entered and has driven around the game room multiple times trying to find his state of mind. There goes another door. Look at this guy. Me to kick some zombie butt. Now, what color's my underwear? Mm, what case it is. This friend turned into a zombie that lost his thinking cap in the process of uh, losing everything else on the way out, including a very unattractive girl. one state of mind. Besides, this guy's also going to lose something else. Yeah. I never used this baby before. Well, I guess I could use this. This might be a best friend. After all, it only does have three strings. Yes. What am I gonna do? How am I gonna track this guy? Yeah. For one, he knows how to open a door. For two, he does not know how to tell, turn on a television. So that's good news. At least he won't break my TV. But for three, he's got a thing for big flat screen TVs. Apparently he uses them as sex toys. He's got a thing for a little big uh, flat screen TVs. Man, he's going to have a thing for this guitar. Read instructions carefully. Head come in contact with bass guitar. Okay. Hit very, very hardly. Do not think twice and be pretend that it's a very annoying guy that you are hitting. And then get a milkshake on the way out. Okay, that sounds good. I got it. Yeah.
kind of a bad hole. That's the problem. This is a closet. Bathroom must be that way. strange closet. Hmm. Could be a trap. But I think I'll stick to my guitar. <sighs> Two choices. Die or die. White rabbit has left its writing on the wall. We follow like Alice and just keep diving down the hall. 